Yeah, it's your boy Fist in his ass, bringing another great edition of Homefront. I love this game. Multiplayer 12v12, dedicated server gameplay. Do you know what that means? No other game has that. 36 players online, Xbox. Look at, look at the reload ammunition. This is the look at C4. Oh my goodness, for the win. Go, kitty, you do. Look at that. Oh my god, I love it. Look at the distance on that C4, it's beautiful. I only, it's probably the second best C4 that I've seen uh, since Battlefield 2. So, um, I don't know what you guys want to call this a TK93, TK, or the uh, Test Weapon 3 here. Rushed in, licking my chops, thought I was going to get the kill. But, um,. It's a Type 3 AK. I'm just going to call it AK. I'll let you guys call it whatever you want in the comments. Uh, there's a couple things I don't like about this weapon regardless. I mean, you hear I'm running a nice sight on it. I'm running steady aim on these. A lot of these assault rifles, like the, uh, like the ACR in the last video and this video, I was running steady aim. Now look at the animation. Uh, got me killed. The animation on the AK-47 is like, it's in two hands. I'm like, what the hell? It's, this is kind of like some Killzone 3 shit. You look at that. Take it in one hand and then reload with the other. Mm, I don't know. I just... If you're a professional military master, you know, like combatant, you're, you should be able to reload your weapon uh, with one hand. Look at that. What is that? Two hands to reload it. It takes too much time to reload this weapon, and you get yourself in trouble. And that got grenaded. Isn't that beautiful? I'm not going to say this is a top tier weapon. Maybe some other people might down the road, but it has way too much muzzle lift. It's all over the place. You know, comparative to other weapons in the game, using Penny Pincher, you are, you will be outweighed in every aspect meaning that you will get beat for that simple fact alone and uh, if you don't have steady aim on this game what's the point because you're not going to be able to hit targets down range now I can say this about the AK that in hindsight I did realize playing is that the AK has a probably the longest shot that hits out of any of the assault rifles so for example on some of the maps where they're up on the billboard I mean you could literally stand in the back of the map and burst fire people and, and hit them like it's got, like I could shoot those snipers up there if I wanted to so you know that that's possible now, some of these things about this game are like I don't know weird in the respect that <laughs> You know, I can't buy the shotgun. Like, somebody was telling me the only way I can get it. Somebody sent me an email saying, listen, you can go here and upload it to a memory disk and then put it on your hard drive. I'm like, I'm not going to do that. Because, first of all, I don't know who you are and I don't know what I'm downloading. And, second of all, it's bullshit that you got a item sitting there and there's no way you can get to it. You can't even you can't, you look at it. But if you didn't buy the game from GameStop and your battle code like you if you you can't rent this game and just play it you can only go up to level five and that's it so what kind of encouragement is that like you can't even i don't understand the um thinking behind chaos i mean literally i can't even log back onto the game because my battle code you know froze from my first account and i can't get out of my second account so it's a big mess and i'm just like i really like i really like i said in my last video i really want to play the game but i can't so i'm gonna go get um Crisis today is Tuesday, and I'm gonna be uh, doing some reviews on that. In the AK-47, it's a great, it's probably the best assault rifle for long distance burst fire. Uh, you can you can shoot up the hip sometime. I'm not. You can see, you can see the steady aim I got on here is pretty. Uh, it's pretty pretty deadly uh, accurate weapon with the burst fire. And uh, we're just holding up this uh, this line. And you can see we're, we're hitting some pretty good shots. Now, you can see I've run out of ammo. And uh, 
I didn't realize that until just now. I'm like, you know, wow, the ammo on it is uh, not that conducive either, meaning that you were going to run out really fast. So here I am. I'm, I'm trying to kill some. I knew I was going to get killed right here because I'm running out in the open trying to get a, a, an assault rifle. And so with the with the bad reload animation the muzzle lift the crazy muzzle lift and you know not enough ammo to carry you through and look at this <laughs> did you see that body how far it flew up in the air that's crazy but uh with that being said uh the assault the ak is a is at a huge disadvantage i mean because Literally, you really don't have to worry about your opponent getting long streaks on you and or using Penny Pincher to be accurate at any type of distance. I mean, you can outgun them all day long. So you can be outclassed, I mean, literally be outclassed by the M4. You can be outclassed by the XM10. XM10 is a really good weapon. And you can be outclassed by the, the M110. And you can be outclassed by the SMGs. I, I think the SMGs are in a probably both SMGs are top tier and just the mobility top tier reload animation SMGs are top tier in this class I mean top tier in this game period there's no way around it I think the only thing that with some practice that could, could battle them is probably like the M4 and the M110 everything else I wouldn't even bother. I mean, unless you, you know, on the XM10, of course. So yeah, you got five weapons probably in this game that are tops. So you, maybe the Vector, yeah, the uh, Diablo, the M110, the XM10, and the M4. Everything else, I, I wouldn't waste my time with it unless you want to challenge yourself. That's about it. Uh, my um, assessment of the whole game in a nutshell now I do like the I did did do some videos the tongue twister here I did do some videos with the master key because I'm sitting here thinking about it and I'm like should I talk about it yeah I did do some videos of the master key and I enjoyed the master key because you know the sh damn thing is powerful I mean that that is a powerful ass extension it's not like that st stupid sounding uh, Call of Duty 4 master key it's like and, and here it's like I'm like damn that's some real shit so yeah cluster bomb loving it cluster cluster ass beating look at that so my overall impressions of the Type 3 AK, eh, meh, meh. I'll give it a, I gotta, look at these camping bitches waiting for me to, I was so mad like you dirty sluts. You won't even move out of your, your spawn. You're just waiting for people to, I mean the people do that in this game. They're so pussy. You won't even come out of your spawn. Just come on dude. I remember Wings saying that, and I was like, Wings is like, well, either people don't come out or spawn at the beginning of the game, and I'm like, what the hell is he talking about? People always come out of their spawn, you know, when I was playing uh, Black Ops, and then I realized, you know, he's right. In these these Battlefield games, people don't come, I mean, battle is type games, these people don't come out of their spawn. I mean, you literally have to go in there and fucking foreclose on them and boot them bitches out evac you know evict your asses get out of there get out of your spawn please I mean what's the point of you camping in your spawn it's like you spawn you flip the spawns you're gonna get your ass kicked anyway it's like yeah, it's so disgusting well I'll be playing some crisis I got the XM10 videos to do and there are some great videos. So I will be uploading both of those. For the last kill. That's how your boy with fist does it. Tongue twisting it up today. Until next time. Rate, subscribe, favorite. It's your boy Fist. Peace. Rate, comment, and subscribe.